boom how's it going ladies and gentlemen in today's episode we are going to install a oil pressure uh, couch in the orthodox skyline so stay tuned so this is the couch the brand is adoko i bought it on aliexpress as usual so let's see what we have inside basically we got the couch the cup the cable the couch itself and uh, the fuel pressure sender unit this one this one is mechanical as you can see right here we got also instructions manual and double sided tape and the cup holder uh, so I believe we will need uh, a extra wire to wire this guy from the bonnet into the car so let's go ahead and show you guys where I'm going to put the sender unit so yeah my car has already a sandwich plate I believe you can see right there the pink uh, the pink thing right there that connects to the oil intercooler so I'm going to insert the fuel pressure sensor right there as you can see we have that bolt so I will take out that bolt and insert the sensor so if you don't have a sandwich plate you will have to buy a new one so this is the wire that I'm going to use to wire the, the sender into the cabin so now with a 12 millimeter socket I'm taking out the top bolt that I have on the sandwich plate so as you can see guys the bolt is out so make sure when you are buying you you send the unit you make sure that the thread is the same this is one uh, one eight uh, or 27 8 NTP you have the the thread size right there so now let's go ahead and plug in the sensor so before I screw it into place first I'm going to wire the cables so basically you have that one that goes to the ground and you have this one that connects into the gouge so I'm go I will go ahead and wrap it then insert it so yeah as you guys can see I have everything right wired up so now I'm going I will go ahead and insert it in there just then change of plans instead of using the one on the top we will have to use the one on the bottom because the one on the top is very tight so let's go ahead now and I screw that one and insert the sensor I believe you can see right there the sensor is in so now it's time to go ahead and ride the things inside of the car Ooh. just right there so as you guys can see right here we have the cable in so now it's time to go ahead inside the car and do the wiring so yes guys I was looking for a place to put it and I believe it will say just right there and the cable will go through uh, the AC vent over there since I have this one I believe it will be a good spot to see the fuel pr the, the oil pressure so now I will go ahead and drill a hole here on the back to make sure that uh, the couch stays properly fixed so yeah guys now we have our uh, guide hole right there on the back so now what we are going to to do is to put double sided tape on the back to make sure that everything stays uh, into on the place and we got double sided tape now I'm, I will go ahead and insert it there and fix it on place since I'm going to use the, the, the vent to drive the wire as you, you can see right there that I made a hole then when I insert it back I will have a way that the tra the wire will travel then I will reuse uh, the power in the ground that I have on this couch in order to make this one work as you can see I have the wire going through the hole 
to the gouge perfect so yeah as you can see it stays right there perfectly so now I had to remove my my dash trim in order to access the cables here so this is the cable that I'm going to reuse to have the power uh, to the unit so basically we have those colors here you can see the red is for the power uh, the green goes to the sensor the yellow is for the lighting and the black is for the ground so now I'm going to wire up those cables so yeah guys now we have everything wired up moment of truth oh yeah we have oh -ho -ho! we have something oh we got we got oil pressure we got oil pressure oh my god so happy <laughs> and we can even change the color of the gouge hmm, blue look at the blue <laughs> sky is blue Woo. so yeah guys I got everything wired up here back on, on the backstage I got the boost working I got the oil pressure working so everything is good, everything is fine. So that's it guys, I hope you enjoyed the video and I see you next time. Cheers, subscribe.